back again with another video vlog or vlog or video uh i'm just checking out i'm looking i'm looking at you but i'm a little checking out i heard some noise over there i think it's a squirrel but there's a, we have all kinds of birds here up on the trees right there there's like a bunch of nests once the leaves fell down you can see all the nests you can see all and there's birds living in there i just don't know what kind because there's every tree pretty much has a nest so and there's just weird noises coming over there so coming from over so i was just checking it out but uh um i was just uh starting a new vlog day i had he's not here yet um it's gonna be working on the sauna I got shaved shaved clean clean and nice cleaned up good got rid of that nasty beard so what I think I'm gonna do today uh, on one of the cars is I'm gonna start on the on the uh, on the project mini this is gonna be a mini camp mini camper you guys see right here turn the camera around so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it inside I'm gonna clean it up right now blow off the leaves I'm gonna put it inside um, um, in the garage and uh, basically um, raise it up. Let's see what mm, this is basically the access panel for the engine right here. I'm gonna remove that. I'm gonna vacuum it, clean it up. I'm gonna remove that. Um, see what belts I need. Uh, I'm gonna change the oil. Get the, get the oil. O'Reilly or AutoZone or any one of those guys they carry the oil um, I know I've checked out online which oil you can use and then also the gear oil for the um, for the drive shaft but the thing is that it's leaking so what I need to do is I need to change the gaskets so I gotta check it out underneath I mean it's in immaculate condition you guys you probably you saw this before you, you already saw this a video about it and me driving it so well what i want to do is i want to fix uh this side is okay a little bit of body damage right there um i want to what i want to do is just basically clean it up fix this big old dent over here on this door which is dented inside and uh i'm gonna probably just mm, spray it in undercoating Mm, make it all black and then we're gonna build a box right here and uh, turn it into a camper so let's go put it inside and uh, start cleaning it up and uh, evaluating what we need and make a parts list and I'll start working on that while Eddie's coming to uh, get the sauna ready he's working on it today and tomorrow still so um for this week so he's supposed to start on the ceiling uh with the cedar and maybe walls or whatever align it just basically start it rough start and then just so he can have an idea what we're working with <music> guys finally got it in here um, drove it in started right up actually it's been outside for a while and on the freezing we had that when we had that uh, Arctic blast or whatever the battery was outside it started right up so good 
got it in we're gonna clean it up uh do off some leaves over here just kind of got rid of them so got it in gonna start cleaning it up and uh making drawings for the for the box i'm gonna get metal sheeting i'm gonna weld on top over here make a box and uh with like a like a free metal frame and then i'm gonna insulate it from the inside with some foam uh dry foam and then it's gonna be basically a sleeper this but we're still gonna have we're gonna do the floor but what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna leave a a panel that's a cutout so we'll be able to remove this at any given time to service the engine obviously because it's right in the middle so we're gonna have to we'll go through that as we as we proceed and uh yeah and the good thing is that these things come down the sides they drop down basically all to three the rear this and the sides they drop down so you can make it flat you can remove them whatever for easy you know disassembly i don't know for anything that you might need you can make this a flat bed so right boys and girls this is the result of my trip to the lumber yard so i got materials for this basically plywood uh, uh, 2 by 12 by 16s for the this is going to be the awning that's going to be basically over there you guys you guys know where that chill area is right there right there so that's going to be the awning he's going to build it soon within a, i think he's coming saturday so we got everything that we need here supposed to supposedly we got everything um the paper for the roofing uh basically uh two by sixes two by eight um the posts right here brackets roofing material right there shingles that's for that yeah <laughs> i hauled this on the truck like this going uh 45 miles an hour on the freeway barely made it here and I also got some two by fours. Um, basically, I went to the, when I talked to the guy at the yard, the sales guy. So I got 62 by fours. And apparently they were before Christmas on the 20th, about tw December 20th or, or 15th. He said it was double the price. So now they're under $3 a piece, which is really, I mean, it's good quality just two by four two by four by eight um so i got 60 pieces that are are gonna be used for random stuff that's maybe add-ons or like a bench or something man i keep looking at the lens uh, at, the, at the screen not the lens sorry about that anyway so this is uh um this is what i got bunch of things bunch of goodies here yeah this is this is like it's a heavy duty load right there for this thing it's hanging over times two so this bed is right now because of the tank it's you know not six and a half feet it's probably five and a half feet and then you have the rest of here hanging <laughs> but i made it nothing fell off nothing broke good good job so, we unloaded all the lumber here randomly because they're gonna be my truck is relieved now no more pressure they're gonna be taking lumber one one by one so it's easier for them like this to have it mixed up so it's easier access they're gonna come saturday and do it in a couple of days but um we're just gonna clean up and uh lexus is back you guys that was another project of mine i didn't talk about but that's this thing only has forty-five thousand miles on it uh, yeah, and I didn't I I just put the mini truck inside But I didn't get a chance to work on it uh, Well to I just clean it up a little but I'll probably start tomorrow because um, uh, I totally f like not forgot but I knew that we had an, uh, a reservation we're going to a restaurant. It's my wife's birthday. So um, shout out to you, honey um, Hope you uh, enjoy this birthday and uh, the presents and um, much love and um, we care for you and uh, as a mom and as a wife all the blessings that you can get get uh, uh, God's blessing 
I hope you will be getting stronger because with the kids and the stress that you go through, it's a lot, it's a lot. And I appreciate the, 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 the work that you put in, into the family and to the house. And so I hope that you, uh, um, that you stay strong as you are and only get stronger and uh, uh, smarter, more beautiful. And uh, we wish you all a happy birthday. Uh, on this note, I'm just gonna end the video. We're just gonna go eat. Um, we'll continue next day tomorrow, guys. Peace.